welcome back to my YouTube. If you hear a little banging, there's just a little baby right there in the side chair looking at us trying to eat our food. <laughs> we are back. You guys have not seen a video of us in forever. So we're doing a QA and a to catch you guys up on our life and we're doing a mukbang while doing it. Y'all asked us questions, so we're going to be answering them. Yes, ma'am. So let's get into it. <laughs> Don't mind Tino. He's just here for the vibes. He's a sushi boy. <laughs> it's good, but it's spicy. That's mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So, listen, what is the first question? What was the most difficult part of your life and how did you overcome it? I don't think I have, I have a lot of difficult times in life. <laughs> <laughs> you said one. <laughs> Just trying to find myself again, you know, like kind of lose yourself to everything else in the world. Trying to find myself again, probably, but that's it. I would definitely say, yeah, I agree that there's been like a lot of times that have been difficult. Not to get too deep or anything, but I had a really rough um, relationship with my mother and that was probably one of the hardest times in my life. I mean, trying to Mm -hmm. Yeah, but here we are. We're grown now. We love our moms. Past that. Has your friendship changed since you had the baby? Maybe like a lot more distance and we don't get to see each other as much. So in know? a way it has changed because I can't just like go and smoke a blow with her like I used to. But now there's a baby with us. It didn't change. I feel like it made us stronger. I love him and he's <laughs> my best friend's baby. <laughs> he's like, say something. <laughs> say something. <laughs> who's the drinker and who's the Smoker. Smoking drink before. My best friend has always been a hardcore smoker. <laughs> so like I think that I became more of like the drinker as time went on. Mm hmm I would say that. Do you agree? I agree. Now I don't really do much of anything, but today like I would probably drink before I smoke. What's the biggest fight you went through together? We went through a lot of stuff together. We um, fought like sisters. And we never even got into a really big fight i think we've mm -hmm. only argued and like stopped talking in the longest i think it was like three months don't ever don't ever do that with your best friend because that was like mm -hmm. probably the hardest thing no, ever <laughs> we're both really sensitive like what my feelings she I ain't think. gonna reach out to me and i'm not gonna reach out to her so it's either one of the we're other stubborn. <laughs> that's another thing first impressions of each other and how y'all met so <laughs> we went to the same middle school i was the new girl and i knew everybody was talking crap about me and basically there's people coming up to me saying like, oh, you um, are going to fight Hope, da, 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 da. And I'm like, who's Hope? <laughs> and then I think you could say the same thing, right? And then, when she first started, a lot of people were telling me she was talking about me. And at that time, I was just like that girl that was just like confrontational. Ready to fight anybody. <laughs> so I went up to her. <laughs> or no, I think we had the same PE together, right? Mm -hmm. It was PE. She came up to me and she was like, I'm Haley. People are coming up to me saying that we, we have issues and that you want to fight me. And then we just went on from there. And we got really close after that. So at first, we're like, why is this girl talking crap about me? Didn't like each other for no reason. Mm -hmm. Literally, that's just how school is, y'all. So if you hear something, don't believe it all the time. Because people be making up anything to you. A lot of people want to see each other be friends either. What was both of your guys' reaction to Ona becoming a mommy? By the way, we love you. We love you too, Faith. Shout out, Faith. I was already scared because I was like, okay, I haven't had my period for over 24 days. But I've always had like an inconsistent period. I've never had a regular period all my life, still to this day. My boyfriend was like, I think you should take a test. I was like, okay. So I go and I take the test and then I'm not thinking anything of it. And then I look and boom, positive test. And I was like, holy shit, <laughs> holy, holy. Wait a minute. So I was scared and then I was like happy at the yes. same time. Give her that dirty look again. <laughs> He's like, you talking about me? Everybody gave her a, a lot of support. Yes. So that's what made it like a lot more like reassuring and calming. But what was your reaction? How did I tell you I was pregnant? Like me and my best friend weren't seeing each other a lot because she lived down the hill and like it was just like hard to see each other and stuff. We had went to the Drake concert. I forgot about we that. drank. And as we were drinking, we got Wendy's and everything. And I was perfectly fine getting ready for the concert. And you know, we got to the concert and we were drinking and I just was throwing up for no reason. Like throwing up like literally she's taking shots and i'm just sitting there like best friend i'm sorry like ugh. you would have thought she was pregnant literally uh i still believe that i was getting symptoms for her <laughs> you know some of the are trying to tell me that my best friend's pregnant so then a couple days later i think a week later my best friend texts me and she's like hey like i want to stop and see you like where are you what are you doing so then she comes 
and I go down to the car and she's like I have to tell you something yeah. and I just look yeah. at her like this could be about anything right now so let me not just you know my adrenaline's running and everything she sh gives me a box and I'm like oh my god this could be anything right now and I opened the box and my heart dropped my heart dropped to my ass y'all like I ain't even gonna lie to y'all I was just like I was like are you serious like this is crazy just cut it short I was excited but nervous for her. And now look at her, she's doing this mommy shit, like. <laughs> I'm like, we're not kids anymore. Like it kind of just like gave us like, whoa. I was thinking she's this whole time. Up. Yes, I felt like I was still 16 on the inside. And I was like, I'm too young. Like I'm a baby, how am I gonna take care of a baby? But I really had to realize like, girl, you're about to be 21. What are you talking about? You're like, more than grown. Yeah, I was a shock, but now I'm still so happy to have this little baby in my life. Too, it was a little positive test in the back. Oh yeah. Mm -hmm. What's Baba's name. Hi, Tino. Tino for short, but Santino is his full name. Take a bite. These noodles is cheesy and very much good. Shout out to my best friend. What do you guys do to keep the friendship the same now that both lives are changing? We send each other like TikToks. We just try to do stuff like this like every Wednesday now, you guys. We want to do videos for you. So stay tuned. We basically just try not to be so distant because it is different now that I have a baby. Hi, best friend. What are you doing? Are you busy this week? Mm -hmm. Like, they pretty much. Just but planned it out. The craziest thing we ever did together. Honestly, we've had a lot of crazy things, you guys. But us being younger, all the nice clothes that we was wearing and shoes and stuff. Makeup. like We was out there hustling for that, stealing it like mm -hmm. and it's bad to say but like shoes and jewelry and nice stuff that you guys all used to be like where'd you get that from where'd you get that from we was in the mall <laughs> throw it in the bag <laughs> the craziest thing i think we've done together like and getting in fights together you're fighting how long have you been with your boyfriend i've been with my my mans for 60 years i've been with my boyfriend for going on three now since we're on this topic there's a question that says does Hope like your boyfriend? Are y'all asked that type of questions? Like, yes, y'all. I like my best friend's baby daddy, okay? He brought in Tino into the world. I like him. He's cool. The question was, how many fights have we been in? Maria. <laughs> oh, not her name dropping. Abby. Oh, what's that girl's name? That one. Serenity. Bitch. Oh, Raven. Raven. I beat that bitch up. I forgot about that fight. There's two bitches who started crying. No, you've had three bitches who started crying after fighting the bitch. <laughs> this is the video that I was trying to show you guys. <laughs> y'all, my best friend did her shit in this video. I promise y'all. <laughs> like, she, <laughs> she was on her, like... Yeah. It's blurry, but I'm gonna leave it blurry so it don't get. Do y'all see this? Yeah, they, she was they, doing her thing. Okay. Tell me not. <laughs> <laughs> this excites us like we're fucking the 14, 14 and again. 15 again. Okay, y'all. So this fight, I fought this girl three times. Yeah, literally. This is this is the second part of the fight, y'all. I got her on the floor, and you guys are gonna see where somebody pushes me away from her. That was my first time ever being able to get this tall, big biatch off of me or on the floor <laughs> <laughs> so it's pain okay I fuck that bitch fuck all the bitches we fought no literally where do you guys see your guys' self in 10 years i get smoking a j watch my kid on the porch <laughs> <laughs> literally <laughs> give, me, give me your boy i'm gonna beat your ass if you don't get your ass up I, I say the same probably with a kid too mm -hmm. chilling talking about bitch right where you at we finna smoke a joint throw the kids in the backyard tell them they can go play i don't take shit serious i'm no. sorry maybe i'll still be doing youtube or something who knows how long have y'all been friends for uh, why is the reason you kept each other in each other's lives like 14 15 16 17 18 19 20 21 22 what the fuck? Nine bitch? years. We're gonna do a 10 year celebration. Mm -hmm. we, nine fucking years with this house. We're just the same person in different bodies, kind of. Yeah, different fonts. How old were you when you first started using makeup? By the way, I love you guys. I started using makeup when I started hanging out with my best friend. She, I used to love her doing my makeup and watching her do her makeup because I used to swear my best friend was the best makeup artist in the world. <laughs> <laughs> and I was so shitty. <laughs> All right, y'all, so that concludes our Q&A. Let us know what ideas you guys want to see us do together because every Wednesday we want to come out with content for you guys. Comment. And we'll do, like, some giveaways, too. That'd be fun to see who constantly mm -hmm. is on here. Mm -hmm. Like, in the middle of the videos, we could do, like, little, like, Q&As and whoever gets to write in the comments, they'll mm -hmm. get a little, you know, gift or something. Yeah. Question of the day is...
Who do you think was more rowdier in our younger years? So let us know who do you think, Hope or me? But yeah, you guys, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and we'll see you guys next week. Peace. Ciao.